I got you. Exhale. I know. I know. Deep breath in. I'm sorry. I know it's good. Okay. There you go. Very good. You did great. And you're the only, I mean, pretty I much know. the only one I trust or I that actually can do it. I know. It's still tough. telling you the when that happens as an avoidance your body flattens out the lower back curve I see that to open up the holes that the nerves go through right. and I know you're saying you're going through some therapy where they were trying to encourage you to to arch that right and then you were feeling pinched pinching mm -hmm. right so the holes the nerves go through that flat back happens as a way to open up the, all the holes that the nerves pass through. Now, when you bring your body back upright, we need it to not just be happening at the area where the disc injuries are. We need it to be bending in your middle back, but this area is frozen. That's where we're, today we're gonna go back in there and loosen that up. And then I know you have the roller, it took a while to get the blocks, but we're gonna go home and retain that and encourage these areas to stay mobile for as long as possible. The best way that we're going to uh, treat your spine is by not chewing on these teeth anymore, by not bending there, and by teaching your body to remember how to bend in areas that have been frozen. And the nerves that come out of your lower back then radiate down your sacrum. So a lot of that, I'll, and I'll check out the sacral joint, SI joint here, but I believe a lot of that, unless, and you said you, the last few months you've been, you've lost weight and you had, do you think you were being more sedentary or no? You think you just, it's um, hard to figure out what caused the pain? No, not really. I mean, I, but no fall or anything? No fall, no. Mm -hmm. No falls. What I'm trying to say is that, that, that in that situation, it's most likely slow progression of disc right. injury. The disc has been slowly getting more aggravated, hitting the nerve more, then radiates down your leg. Yeah, and it'll, it might even go on the way down to your foot eventually, but let's... It does. My point. <laughs> the neurosurgeon yesterday um, looked, and he said it's almost an opening, like a sore, where it's been so... You know what I mean? Like, like if I can't, I can't sit. There's a sore. Can, is it visible on the skin, or is it's it? It's visible. It's visible on the skin. And he said that there's probably there's tissue swelling. He can tell by looking at the area. So he told me to start icing. Mm -hmm. And he's like a pressure ulcer. Does he think it's from pressure? Constant it's pressure. Pressure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to. That's what I'm trying to say about you know, the sacral the end of the end of the coccyx is a lot of nerve endings in there and just yeah. having inflammation in there is going to cause an immense amount of pain a lot of nerve endings in there and either the way you were positioned for a period of time you know that pressure right damaged some t something in there but we need to you know get you moving lounging on your side you know it's not good to have a constant level of pressure on that coccyx right, right. Um, like a plane ride and a car ride roll your side a little bit we'll be tight just roll your side okay just roll your side Roll my side. Yep. Okay. Okay. All right. Take a deep breath in for me. Just lay it back on your back. I got you. Exhale. I know. I know. Deep breath in. I'm sorry. I know it's good. Things will wake up here. Breathe in deep. I got you. Always breathe. Let it go. Exhale. Here we go. All right. It's okay. It's okay. Breathe in deep. Exhale. Let it go. Exhale. Just tie up on there. We got worked out. Oh, I'm just standing back. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I got gotcha. you. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Breathe. It's okay. Real gentle. Here we go. Chin up for me. Now relax. Hey, you're beautiful. You did great. You did great. I know it's tough. It's all sore in there. If your neck loved to be adjusted, you wouldn't have fluid in your middle ear. <laughs> It's that tension in your neck that is the cause. And so we're drawing attention to it, which 
And no, I, I don't. I don't blame you. It's it's going to be difficult to confront this. This is why you can't find anybody. Nobody wants to do the hard work of making us shine a light into the rooms that have monsters in them and have old injuries and traumas that our bodies held on to. And you know, I don't blame you. It's it's so sore. Yeah. It, it, Quiet visit costs double. Uh, I'm teasing. <laughs> just you know, paid her. I'm doing exactly. I'm just teasing. Oh, smart lady. Okay. I'm just teasing. Am I paying full? There you go. There you go. But yes, it can, you know, it's discounted if you let me talk. There we go. Can you tell like where my traps like right there connect? It's a mess. How it's bad? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. These, I can feel it myself. These are the roots down here in your shoulder. You got to push these roots down. Rock. Yeah, yeah, just connections oh. here. I know. Oh my. that are sick need to go to the doctor. <laughs> you understand? Mm -hmm. I mean, yes, it's great if healthy people can stay healthy and go to a doctor and be taught how to stay healthy, but, you know, I think it's Jesus, didn't Jesus say that? <laughs> it's the sick that need a doctor. <laughs> you know, you know, it's like, this is, you need to be here. Is it, you need help, Arad. I'm looking for help. And you're, all, I mean, pretty I much know. the one I trust or I that actually can do it. I know. I'm not going to ask your spine to do anything outside of the realm of what it's supposed to do. Mm -hmm. As difficult as it might feel, and Ed, you're pushing pretty hard, I, I expect the bone to be able to do this, and they need to be able to do this willingly and easily. Mm -hmm. There we go. Breathe in your nose, out your nose, or in your nose, out your mouth. Just There you go. Try to let your body sink into the table, let your body go. all drain down the neck. You start here. Oops, start here at the bridge of the nose, and then go around the ear. Everything's sore. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah. Mm. in life and stress we clench our jaws you know it's mm -hmm. another way we hold you know traumas that have happened to us and I know you've been through so much and together and just trying to unglue them mm -hmm. a little bit, get them to be able to rotate. 
just like try to my one ear was glued last time because yeah. <laughs> it wouldn't come off. <laughs> it's like oh, I'm gonna get it. This one it doesn't want to do nothing. Perseverance. My little brother did taekwondo for years, and there's like a a creed that they make you say when you're doing taekwondo, and you have to say perseverance. And when he was really young, he couldn't say perseverance, and so it came out perseverance. <laughs> Spears, double spirit, sir. <laughs> so never hear perseverance. Perseverance. Max is like really in. Come on. My son, when he's little, he instead of saying home, he'd say home. Home. Yeah. You. He always did. He did it from the time he could talk, like home. Mm. What's this called? The S. What's it called? Sternocleidomastoid, yes. SCM, yeah, mast cuts the mastoid right here. Yeah. That's part of what the tight, I know, mm -hmm. the tighter that muscle gets, the more it blocks that drainage. Yeah. My son has that really bad too. I really wish he could came with me, but he had to work. How old is he? 24. 24. He has it really bad to where it swells up. That's right, because he was, he was supposed to. He was, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Head relax, I got you. There you go. Hands coming out. Usually don't get too much out on the SCM unless there's a lot in there inside, and that's what I'm seeing here. Really? A lot. I bet my son would just be, I can't even imagine. But also oh, be, that feels I like know, groping, doesn't it? I know, like, it's going to feel amazing when we get this out of here, though. I guarantee it. There you go, you're fine now. There it is, yeah, ropey. Oh, it's all congested. That's all my lower back is, they said I'm just pure rope all up my muscle. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Am I a mess already on that right side? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's quite oh, the right's all, yeah, it's mm -hmm. all dark. I can't tell you how bad that hurts, but it feels good at the same time. It's going to be amazing once we get all this out of here. It's just, it's just all trapped. It's just He's like, after this, I'm calling it a day. <laughs> yeah, go, because you don't play back till tomorrow, right? No, I said he's going to call it a day, because oh, he's, he's got his work cut out for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he'll leave. <laughs> he'll play like my cut carpal tunnel today. <laughs> my hands have stopped talking to me a long time ago. Yeah. They realized I wasn't going to listen to him. Just kind of mundane kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Did you sharpen that thing? No, it's what's inside that's sharp. <laughs> the broom only picks up the pebbles that are inside. If there weren't pebbles inside, it'd feel smooth. Like it feels like a knife going down my neck. Mm. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, I know he's not doing it very hard. Mm. Mm. There's days I'm like, your elbow is pointier today. He's like, no, your back is more dirty mm. today. <laughs> I got you. Gentle. Come on. Mm -hmm. Let me have it. There you go. Rex here. There you go. You'll be great. Yes. I know you're holding out on me. I know. We're dancing partners. We're going to dance together and we'll dance well. I'm not going to step on your toes. But I had a guy step on my toes really bad one time and it hurt really, really bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so there's, that, there's I, don't, I don't blame you. I felt that all the way down my back. I know. It's, it's, we got to get all this out of here. Oh, gentle. It's okay. There you go. Very good. You did great. There. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, you do what you got to do. What do you do for fun? What's your... 
Nothing. Nothing. Come on. Not not right now. TV shows, nothing. No oh books. yeah, yeah. I watch. Yeah, I read books. Okay, well tell me. And I, I. What TV shows you like right now? What do you have? Um, I just got. I just watched Inventing Anna. Inventing Anna, Anna. on Netflix. Okay. It's, it's a true story, but yeah, okay. it's good. It's like a limited time series. Oh, oh yeah. Mm-hmm. And if I say ow, you just keep going. Mm-hmm. It's just part of me. This is ever long. Gotta promise not to stop when I say. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. I was like trying to hold it so as long as I could. <laughs> I should have probably breathed through that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't think I breathed through it the whole thing. Like for her tailbone, Ed, is there, you, there's no special. All right, so we have pressure ulcer. You know, we have okay, yeah. pressure on the area for an extended period of time. And the tissue, will, all of that tissue is un, ultimately under the control of the very nerve that's aggravated. So. <laughs> We're going to catch 22 here, right? We want the area to heal, but the nerve that controls it's not very happy. So ultimately, we have to get the nerve happy. Otherwise, you have delayed healing at the very, at the, at the best, just delayed or no healing. You know, so we need to clean your spine, get you stretching your middle back at home, right. get you back on track here. That's what today's about. There we go. Right there is a mess. There's your. You ain't gonna tell me. Mm-hmm. All right, yeah. That's where it stems from, right? Like, when right there, when you're like at the bottom part of my back, yes, like, it feels like um, no circulation has been there. It feels like when you run, yes, like you get circulation, like it immediately got it. Yeah. Okay. I don't know how it did it so quick, but it did. Mm-hmm. I feel like I just ran with my back. Mm-hmm. Oh, did your massage person cup you? Yeah. Okay, good. I was like, what's he cupping? But they'll leave it on for like a minute or two. I need like eight minutes. Or at least ten. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I don't know. I mean, it's not. I don't like the sliding cupping at all. Everybody's so everybody's so scared. Don't want to make too big of a bruise. I don't care. I know, I know, but it's it's a Morgan and Morgan bill we live in. So much lawyers, perhaps. Everybody's afraid of. Or making people too sore. I don't know. I don't get it. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh. That's where you need the cupping. That's yeah. where it needed to have been. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they are putting it on the symptomatic areas. Right, but they yeah, they put, put it on there. I know they're putting on they're putting on the effect. Yeah, they're not going to the cause. This being frozen is the cause. You have to unlock this. If you don't fix the cause, the effect. Now, do you do cupping? Yes, I mean I'm going to go. To me, the the gua sha is a is be- more just complete, as good, more complete yeah. product. Now it's more intense. It's more labor intensive on my part. There it is. I know my sound effects are ridiculous, but oh! I know, I know, and I'm, I'm going for it. Come on. Come on, let me have it. All right, all right. Come on. It just lays right there to the, the right. Attachments, these are attachments. Oh, five, that's one, yeah. I feel these are attachments. Do you feel how ropey it is? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Guarding. It's all yeah. guarding. It's just injury, disc injury. Of course, there's going to be guarding. You have a disc injury. Yeah. It's it like goes all the right, all the way around here, right. hard as a rock, right here. It wraps around the nerve, yeah. radiates up lateral. And it radiates pain.
Five more seconds. Do you feel those knots? Mm -hmm. Okay. I just mm -hmm. have it all with me, just feel them. Mm -hmm. They wrap around like the sides. Mm -hmm. oh. Is that from, would that be from like my back, like my injury? Yes, these are, part of these are little spasms, trigger points from the muscles being tasered. You know, there, there might be little lymph nodes in here too sometimes, but they're, yeah, these, like these right here, these are all just spasms. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. oh. I know you're barely touching me because that's, that's what you say. I know. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> Need a break, just. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is what I'm here for. Mm -hmm. Right there. You got like the bonus mm -hmm. on the elbow. Are they pointy? Look at her tongue all the time. Yeah. It's like knife elbow. It feels like a big old, just bubble, like a big old knot. Mm -hmm. Is it a knot? Yes. If it's not, it'll do till the knots get here, but yes, that is a knot. Uh -huh. Sciatica, isn't it? Mm -hmm. He feels so good anyway when he doesn't. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, I can feel it still, but I mean, he's hitting right on it. Mm -hmm. Right on the side. Yeah. This is just it right here. This is the this is the end of the spinal cord, the beginning of the cauda equina, yep, right here. You know, she's in a lot of pain there. I'm going to just keep doing that right there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you bet my father, you never let him know where you hurt. You know, no, so, no, no. <laughs> Oh, it hurts you there? Make, you make your father sound like mm -hmm. he's just the worst. But he's been my chiropractor for my whole life. Oh, my God. Uh -huh, I know what he does. <laughs> I wish I could have me as my chiropractor. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I know what he does. You guys all have options. I don't. <laughs> Does he still work on your back? He comes in. Yeah, does he it? comes with me. Works up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know what he does. He does this. I know. Yeah, exactly. Oh, if it hurts, oh, he's going twice as hard. <laughs> yeah. 
And so I get hurt right there, because let me dig it. That's right. Oh, no, that's who trained me. No, oh. there shouldn't be anything. You should be looking at me going, Ed, you weeny little man, is that all you have? That's what, that point. That's what he wants you to say. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Like he's using like a screwdriver and stuff in your back. And you're just falling asleep. <laughs> you should be falling asleep through this. Like, <sighs> You ever seen the movie Moana? Okay. Okay, so I guess there's a thing called the Heart of Tefiti. My my 18 month old, my seven year old loved it. Now my 18 months old watching it, and so there's a nice little heart on your back, you know. And at one yeah. point, Dwayne the Rock Johnson, you know, the one character is looking at the rock and going, you know, get back the heart. He's like, oh, you don't need it. Besides, I got a better one. And he <laughs> shows her like, <laughs> a, oh my God. <laughs> besides, I got a better one. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Like fire. Mm-hmm. Just like fire burning. I knew he was going to say that. Don't, oh, come on. I knew he was going to say so that. So funny. I just set you up right there. Thank you. <laughs> so you can't even see the, you can't even see the cupping anymore. You see? That is fire right there. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's, if anything's it's going all out there. It's all terrible. Yeah. <laughs> why fair why wear them when I gotta get they just be in the way. Yeah. Oh gosh. Well I can tell the my thoracic area feels a lot mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. feels a lot softer. Right, it's the same pressure. There's the same pressure as in Are you serious? It's the same there's the same pressure I was Put on your glute. That's how sore the glute tissue is. The same. Oh my gosh, that's unreal. Yeah, you got to get all this soreness. You got to. Many places have a no below the belt policy. It's like, okay, how am I going to get this area clean? I don't. I don't care. Right, but I'm saying that you have to find something. I mean, your wife's right there. You know, mm -hmm. I don't care. You got to get somebody to dig in here and yeah. find. Clean all that out of there. Oh. Mm -hmm. side of your back and mm -hmm. like bruises on the glutes there. I mean, that's bad, like, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah no, it's all a lot of, it's all congestion. It's where that's where the roller and the middle back. I'm glad you didn't lower back some because you could tell I'm just. Well, I'm saying even that, like I said, that, that, that bruise, that's where the cupping, those are the cupping marks and they're all gone now. I've already. Yeah. This, this rounding is because of avoidance. When your body comes upright, this is where you belong, but it makes the holes the nerves go through smaller. A little easier to come up right now. Like yeah, that. yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, so you, because I got your middle back unlocked. So that now you can come up right without it all happening. See, I feel amazing. I mean, just like I did before, if I'd had my stuff, you know, I would have been fine. Yeah, you know, I'd have kept with it. Easier to, easier to stand up right now yeah. because we've. It, it is easier to stand up. Yep. I don't have my, I don't have my butt's out, but. <laughs> we have time. <laughs> it's okay. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. I think you just tore my hip off. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and tilt your head to the right for me. There we go, that's it. Tilt your head right. Yeah. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> right. Go ahead and tilt to the left. Okay, a little bit. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. How about that one? Go ahead and tilt to the left for me. <laughs> it makes me want to do that. <laughs> that was a lot. <laughs> that was a lot. Yeah, you're just hanging out here. Just hanging oh, out. Oh, it just popped. Good. Yeah. You just 
turn you down. About every minute, I'm gonna go a little quicker, but look, one, roll down one inch. Breathe, drag your bottom, there you go. And you move down one inch. Oh, wow. Every minute, one inch. You bring that down to your middle back area, it's just gonna feel phenomenal when you, by redirecting all the motion to your middle back where it's not injured, all the teeth that aren't cracked, the ones that are cracked are gonna go, thanks. <laughs> Part of what happens is when you lose the lower back curve, it goes into a, an accentuated yeah. hyperkyphosis of your upper back. So as you push the upper back in, you restore the curve to your lower back. Right. There's only so much curve in the spine. So you were just moving around to different positions. Perfect. And then you move one inch, go ahead and push, and then yep, try to, yep, roll. You move your way down the spine, and it's just a journey. Yeah. Oh, thank Hello. you. All right, hang in there. I'll be back, though. Yeah.